Yo, hello everyone, it's Marcel Fischer here, and today we are testing how realistic is the safety car speed in the F1 2021 game. We are comparing it to the real life times at three tracks, Bahrain, Baku and Imola in the wets. Let's go. First, we will have a look at Bahrain. In real life, there was a safety car right after the beginning as Mazepin crashed out at the opening lap. The whole field was bunched up like in this test in F1 2021. I did the test with the 100% AI at the full race distance. For both real life and F1 2021, we compare the lap times of lap number 2. As you can see by the screenshot from the race director, Verstappen, who was the whole lap behind the safety car, did a lap time of 2 minutes and 7.2 seconds behind the safety car. Now let's have a look for the real life times they did behind the safety car. Verstappen did a lap time at lap number 2 of 2 minutes and 22.4 seconds, with Hamilton 3 tenths slower. That's about 15 seconds slower than the safety car wash in the game. It could be that where Mazepin's car is recovered, the safety car was driving a bit slower than the safety car in the game, but that wouldn't make up a difference of 15 seconds. That's Bahrain, so now let's head over to Imola, where we compare the lap times of the safety car in the wets. For that test, we are comparing the lap times of lap number 3 for both game and real life, as this was the first full lap behind the safety car. And in the game, the top three guys all did a lap time of 1 minute and 57.37 seconds. And in real life, Verstappen, who was directly behind the safety car, like Bottas here in the game, did a lap time of 2 minutes and 23.2 seconds. That's about 26 seconds slower than in the game. This could be due to the spot where the cars were recovered, the safety car was slower, or the rain was a bit heavier than in the game. And all of this is not 26 seconds of a difference. After that, I had the idea to test the safety car speed in heavy rain conditions, and it really surprised me because the lap times were exactly the same, also a 157.23 in this area. So it's no different in the game if it's light rain or heavy rain for the safety car. And then I thought, okay, let's test it also in Imola for dry conditions. And the result of that is that the safety car is just about 3 seconds faster than in the wets. Didn't expect it that, I thought the difference will be bigger. What do you thought? Write it down in the comments. And the last test for today's video brings us to Baku, where lap number 33 was a full lap behind the safety car with a bunch up field. And the top 3 guys all did low 2 minute 55s. Let's have a look for the times in the game now. In the game, they did lap times of 2 minute 24.4 seconds. But if we compare the sector times, you see that in the first sector, they lost 10 seconds in real life to the times in the game. In the second sector, only 3 seconds and they lost about 20 seconds in the last sector. And this could be due to the debris and the recovery of Stroll's car at the main straight. Because of that, the safety car was really slow. But still, without that, the times would be about 10-15 seconds slower than in the game. That's it for the safety car test in this video. I really thought the safety car in the game is really slow. But in real life it's even slower. I didn't expect it that. So write a nice comment, subscribe if you haven't, so you don't miss any Formula 1 content. And I see you soon.